Tonight's La Lima family has just one wish, and that's for help in getting to the hospital to see their son, their brother, their uncle. As Kathy Moneno tells us, he's on a long road to recovery since an accident earlier this year. 17-year-old Elton Naki Jr., a starting corner for the Castle High School football team, a guard on the basketball team. He's the older brother to two sisters, a younger brother to a sister who gave birth last May. And just three days after becoming an uncle, Elton was riding in the bed of a pickup truck and fell out. He had brain surgery and was in a coma for 31 days, had a stroke while in a coma. He remains at Kapi'olani Medical Center today. It's been rough. Um... It's, it's been so much um, to endure. Elton's mother, Arlette, says he's doing better. He does rehab, working on mobility, trying to get him to walk, talk, eat again. They take him out of bed and push him around in his wheelchair. But recovering from traumatic brain injury will be a long road. We hang on. Um, to hope because of how much he he fights every day. The more we see him fight, the more stronger we become, you know, and that's what's good about it. Um, and that's where our positive reaction to everything every day comes out from. Arlette says they're so grateful for the doctors at Kapi'olani and just knowing people are supportive. And that's enough, she says. But after we kept asking, she said transportation in order to get to Elton while also getting his sisters to their activities is something they're working toward. Right now, they travel by bus. So like one of our, our goals this year or at least by the beginning of next year was to get like a, a vehicle that is able to transport us to and from the hospital. Other than that, Arlette says Elton is their Christmas this year. Just by this incident changed us tremendously. Taught us so many things that people take for granted today, you know, and just for Elton living and breathing and having a second chance is basically our Christmas. If you'd like to help, please go to our website, khon2.com, and click on Laulima. Kathy Munano, KHON2 News.